Good morning everyone! In today's video I wanted to do something a little more general. I wanted to share with you my healthy morning routine. Since I got sick, I obviously haven't been able to work and I've been trying to take advantage of that in any good ways that I can. So I've been trying to establish healthy and productive routines that I can implement into my life once I go back into it, once I go back to work and living my busy lifestyle that I miss so dearly. So this is where we're at with the egghead situation. Thank you, Chemo, for taking away most of my eyelashes and eyebrows and this lovely hair. It's like kind of growing back, but it still looks really weird. But you know, egghead gang. Anyways, let's get to the video. So I try to get up decently early to start my day. And then first thing I do is make my bed. And then the second thing that I do is head on to the living room and open up all the blinds and windows. I just love fresh air and natural sunlight first thing in the morning. Next thing that I do is make breakfast. I always wake up so, so hungry, so I have to eat first thing or else I just like, I can't focus on anything else. So for breakfast, I always make my organic oats. Next, I throw in a bunch of berries. So I actually hate the taste of oatmeal by itself. So I actually eat it with quite a few things put in it. Berries, obviously healthy fruits. I love a mixture of them, so I just dump them right in. This is what the oatmeal looks like, much more colorful, but that is not all. I'm still really picky, and I would usually use organic yogurt, but we don't have any, so today I'm just going to use plain Greek yogurt, still packed with lots of protein and lots of other benefits, so mmm. So this is what my oatmeal concoction ends up looking like. I know I'm really weird, but I just absolutely love it. It's packed with lots of nutrition. And then while I am getting my breakfast ready, I always like to get my coffee ready also. So I need to have coffee in the morning or else I just can't function normally and I get pretty bad headaches. So the coffee that I'm trying out right now is called Kick and Horse Coffee. It's the Three Sisters Medium Blend. It is USDA organic and fair trade. I actually really like it so far. It is a little bit on the pricier side, but I mean, it is organic and it is healthy. So give it a go, see how I like it, and if I'll buy it again. When I eat breakfast, I'm not gonna lie, that's usually when I go through all my social media, just to kind of catch up what I missed on overnight, I guess. I also like to browse through the news. I'm a huge like news geek. I love knowing what's going on in the world. And then yeah, I just kind of try to plan out my day if I have some errands to run or if I have things to do or if I don't have things to do, I try to find things to do because yeah, sitting at home for me is just a no-go. I just try to kind of make a plan for the day or even if it's just like cleaning the house, make a plan for what I'm gonna clean. Alrighty, so I just finished my breakfast and now it is time for coffee. So I have completely made the switch from regular milk to almond milk. I feel that my body feels so much better and I love the taste of it. So I put in a little bit of almond milk and I've completely stopped putting, oh my gosh, of course. <laughs> I've completely stopped putting sugar in my coffee. Um, and I actually love the taste much more now that it's less sweet. And I just put a nice kind of coffee, not spilling everywhere hopefully. And the house smells like coffee. Oh, I love it. After I have my breakfast and my coffee, I really like to do a quick cleanup around the house. I hate mess and it like irks my nerve if the floor is dirty or if there's dishes and the counters aren't clean. So first thing in the morning, I just like to get out of the way and do like a really quick cleanup. That way when I'm out and about or if I'm kind of like walking around the house, the house is clean and I feel great. So I relaxed a little bit after breakfast and now I am on my way to the gym. So I just finished my workout. Definitely beat me up, but I feel amazing. It's crazy to think like a month ago I couldn't walk up the street without feeling lightheaded or even just like up the stairs at my house, I'd have to take a break at the top because I thought I'd faint and I just did a full workout for an hour and it was very similar to the workouts I used to do before I got sick and I feel amazing, I feel great. So that's a really big achievement for me. I almost feel like crying, but yeah, so. Things are looking up, things are slowly getting better. The gym I actually go to is really close to my house, which is super convenient because I can walk there. And that way that's like my warm up. So it's like a 10 minute walk, which is the perfect amount of time to warm up. And then I get to kind of have a little cool down and walk home as well and get some fresh air while I'm at it. I love how convenient that is. Now I'm gonna head home and I'm gonna make a super healthy jam packed smoothie. And then after that, I'm gonna make myself some healthy lunch and then get on with the rest of my day. 
Hey, so we have made it home and it is time for a smoothie because I am starving. So gonna have a nice nutrition packed protein smoothie after the workout always is a good idea. For today's smoothie, this is what we are going to have. So we have flax seeds, which are a good source of omega-3s and have fiber in them. Chia seeds, also a good source of omega-3s. They lower your blood sugar and cholesterol levels and they are good for your heart. We've got turmeric, which is an anti-inflammatory. It helps with liver and brain function. Matcha powder, which helps detoxify your body and an antioxidant. Then we get some wheatgrass, also antioxidant. There have been studies that say it helps kill cancer cells, so why not? Give me all the cancer cell killers. Almond milk, because I like my smoothies to be a little more liquidy. Protein powder, because we need protein. And then all the berries. Oh, and last but not least, Greek yogurt. Mm, it always turns out such a lovely color. Delicious. Mm. It's actually really good. So yeah, the smoothies are like a perfect pick me up for after the gym or even just like after breakfast or actually at any point in the day, smoothies are always a good thing. If you follow me and have been following me on Instagram, PS, I post a lot more about my cancer journey and just my day to day life on there. But if you do follow me on Instagram and have been, you'll know that I do love my smoothies. I do sometimes post random recipes of smoothies, but usually my smoothies are a concoction of what I have in my fridge, plus some healthy powders. But they always end up tasting differently, which is good, I guess, keep it switched up. So that wraps up pretty much my healthy morning routine. Like I said, I try to take advantage of the time that I have now to make some healthy habits and break some bad ones. Thank you so much for your continued love and support. I really appreciate it. I will keep you guys updated with health updates as soon as I know them. But for now, know yourself, know your body, and until next time.